Assalamu alaikum everyone. So for today's video, I am going to be showing you guys how to use the splash uh, option in the app Polish, which is a newly added feature to this app. So what this option basically lets you do is, you know, choose certain objects in the picture, keep them in their original color while leaving the remaining in monochrome. So it's a lot like this. So for example, the picture displayed over here right now on screen I turned it into this with the app so with the newly feature of the app so I'm really excited to show you guys how to do this what is really interesting to me is that initially I thought that you're only a lot, uh, you can only do this kind of editing like you know selecting certain objects tweaking it adjusting it to your choice to be able to done only in like you know computer based photo editing devices i mean uh, app uh, softwares but uh to be able to do this in a phone editing app uh so like a phone picture editing app it's really interesting and new right so let us go to polish i've already uploaded the picture in the app so what we're going to do is if you observe on the panel down there is this option called effect now uh what you are gonna do is basically press on it now on the right hand side you can see that there is this option which looks like a dropper like the dropper icon press on it that's the option we're gonna go for so polish has like a ai based system inside it so naturally it identifies any object that you might want to keep uh, in the picture for, uh, like it's not just based on the splash option it does for the other options in this app too uh, like you know like guys let me know if you want to see more tutorials like this I would be happy to do it inshallah so as you can see the AI system has already chosen uh, the shape over here but I just don't want only the shape I want this other ride over here you see this one too what this basically right is it is called an agordola for those of you who don't know this is like a ride uh, that's similar to ferris wheel but uh, like if a ferris wheel went two times the speed 2x times the speed it normally goes not even 2x like 4x that's what an agudola is basically so as you can see down uh, like in the first color row there is this option color gray and manual and right below them there is splash and shape so what color let's start with the manual manual if I press on it, it's basically certain colors. You can choose any of these colors over here you want. I'm just going to choose a color that's more eye-catching to the eyes because so that you guys can see. And uh, just put it wherever you want. It's basically like this. So you choose the color. You put it all over wherever you want. I literally made this quite a different look. <laughs> and it doesn't have to be just one color. It can be any color. You choose the color and you put it on the picture wherever you want. Now let's erase them back in case you're wondering where was the erase option. It's right beside the brush option. Okay, wait a minute. I might have to go out again and come back in. Then what the gray option lets you do is that it lets you, you know, remove the colors that exist in the picture. So over here you can see I've removed the red parts of the shape almost halfway through. And color is the opposite of gray it lets you add color so let's say over here I'm, not, I'm just gonna do this very roughly not seriously because uh, I'm not doing it for any serious issues right now right and then there is the option oh by the way you can also adjust the size of your brush 
Now, it actually takes a long time to do this as opposed to the time it would take doing it on a computer-based uh, photo editing soft, soft, software. Ah, software, because usually you have your mouse and it's much more easier to do any sort of adjustment. But here it's you and your tip of your fingers. So it takes time. So now the other option that is left to explain uh, among other more obviously so there is the shape option you press on it and it lets you you know have the colors in the picture in a certain shape it could be any shape you want it doesn't have to be like restricted I mean it's restricted in <laughs> according to the shape over here because on the app but uh, yeah and you can also remove the border if you want so I'm just gonna go back to the square option because it's more easier to understand you can remove the border if you want you can see that I have removed the border over here and you can add the border too it's up to you totally and then there is the option of reversing so what reversing will now do is that whatever part of the picture has the color now, it's gonna go monochrome and the monochrome parts are gonna go uh, colorful. So there you go. And I guess that's it for today. This is the explanation I had and this looks weird. So yeah guys, I hope this, uh, I hope this tutorial was easy and understandable, not too lengthy, not too messy. And yeah, let me know if you guys want to see more tutorials like this. Please do check out the app Polish, I think it's really awesome. I, I'm not being forced to tell this anyhow, I actually use this to edit a lot of stuff that off, on my Instagram and other sites. So yeah, so catch you guys in the next video soon, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum.